What's going on everybody and we are officially settling in the year 2015 and looking forward to what it will bring. But the question in today's video is what are the best iOS games of 2014? Which games in the App Store left the biggest mark on the fellow gamers? Personally I went through dozens of dozens of apps in 2014 and the list of top 5 iOS games in no particular order for me is absolutely spot on and diverse. I do wonder however what are your thoughts, what are your top 5 iOS games in 2014 so come on don't be shy let me know in the comment box below and let's do this so the first game I'd like to talk about is Wayward Souls it's an action-adventure game built for quick playthroughs and massive amount of replay value you can download it from the App Store for as low as $6.99 you could either call it an action RPG with roguelike aspects or roguelike with an action RPG aspects procedurally generated random levels mean that every time you play the game it's a different experience you can control one of the six characters all with their own unique playstyles abilities and equipment explore and fight for survival in combat where your tactics, positioning and timing matter the most. The attention to detail is evident all throughout Wayward Souls. There are tons of enemies, gorgeously detailed and beautifully animated. The player characters themselves look great with fantastic animation quality. There's plenty of elements just there to add to the atmosphere, like lamps hanging out from chains that swing when you run into them. That is some of the best sprite artwork I've seen in ages. Stunningly beautiful, jam-packed with replay value and secrets, and loaded with tons of great action, Wayward Souls is an absolute must-have. Seeing everything this game has to offer will take tons of time, but it's time you want at all mind spending because it's just so downright enjoyable. This is easily the top of the heap as far as mobile action RPGs go. In the next game we have an absolute delight, XCOM Enemy Within. It's a standalone expansion to the 2012 strategy game of the year, XCOM Enemy Unknown, and it's now available on the iOS devices. Enemy Within features the core gameplay of Enemy Unknown plus more exciting content. You can check out the new soldiers, abilities, enemies, maps, missions and multiplayer mode for the fresh new strategy gaming experience. Just in case you're new to the party, this franchise started back in 1994 and got ridiculously fantastic reboot in 2012. A year later, Enemy Within launched and now it's here to monopolize the free time of the iOS strategy enthusiasts. XCOM games pretty much follow the same basic formula. Aliens are invading, it's up to you to command, a fighting force capable of resisting and repelling them. Gameplay is turn-based combat heavily reliant on getting your people into cover to set up flanking maneuvers on the alien scum. Some have complained that the added perks you get make the game too easy, but I still found plenty of challenge to be had in rushing through maps to get hold of each bit of melt I could find. In all, I didn't find any of the add-ons of Enemy Within to be less than stellar. If you're even slightly interested in turn-based games, this one is not one to miss. I don't know what else to say, I mean just look at the gameplay footage, it just looks glorious. And the third game on our list, it is another sequel, and it's only $4.99 on the app stores. The spirit of Battleheart returns reimagined. In Battleheart Legacy, you will explore a rich and detailed fantasy world, customize your unique hero with dozens of powerful skills and items, do battle with hordes of enemies, encounter quirky characters, and discover the stories of troubled realm. Will you become a powerful wizard or a notorious rogue? A noble knight or a savage barbarian? How will you forge your legacy? Battleheart Legacy is cheerful and pretty. It's bursting with ideas and its copious grinding is never an issue. But what I love the most about it is how accessible Mica Mobile has made the hardcore RPG. In transposing unwieldy and unyielding RPG tropes into more direct action orientating setting and including a light narrative free of teenage melodrama, it's managed to make a sometimes esoteric genre utterly welcoming. But Battleheart Legacy is easily among the best games I've played this year and I can't imagine a reality where it isn't on the top iOS games of 2014 list. Battleheart Legacy is the game you must play. And fourth on our list we got Monster Hunter Freedom Legacy. The world's most exciting hunting action game, Monster Hunter Freedom Unite is now available for iOS. Whether you are a rookie or veteran hunter, intuitive touch controls will help you to tackle the biggest and baddest monsters out there. Enjoy the hunt. Monster Hunter is an action game that is often mistakenly thought of as an RPG. And while it does have RPG elements in its equipment and quest systems, the real progression for the player is 
is in skill and knowledge, not higher levels and new abilities. There are so many ways to progress through Monster Hunter Freedom Unite, with a multitude of quests to complete, you can choose to tackle something new or go back and replay a quest you've already cleared, with new weapons and tactics. How you play the game is really up to you. You embark on quests with numerous objectives, from gathering items to slaying monsters, if you're successful, you'll reap the spoils, which you can use to create and enchant weapons and armor, and once you've buffed up your character, you'll be ready to take on even bigger quests. You could spend literally hundreds of hours playing through all of the content it has to offer. This is a flawless version of an incredible game, and my hat goes off to the people at Capcom for putting this together. And number 5th on our list, it's a bit of a surprise, it's not a game that is any close to being up my alley, but I must admit it is completely addicted and I highly recommend it enough to put it on that list. Monument Valley, you will manipulate impossible architecture and guide a silent princess through a stunningly beautiful world. Monument Valley is a surreal exploration through fantastical architecture and impossible geometry. You will guide the silent princess through mysterious monuments, uncovering hidden paths, unfolding optical illusions and outsmarting the enigmatic crow people. The story itself is sort of subdued, you get little snippets here occasionally by text and the little cards for each stage tell a lot, but much of it must be pieced together by carefully observing and thinking about the symbolism of things playing out in front of you. We are never really told exactly what's going on and although the ending kind of serves as a closure, if you're like me you'll probably be sitting there afterwards still trying to puzzle out exactly what the developer was trying to express. As as soon as the credits finished, I wanted to start again from the beginning and try to pick up the new information by playing through once more. It's that kind of a game. It's a feast for your senses, it's mysterious and vague enough to keep you thinking and it has great snappy pace to it without ever feeling rushed. It's a mystery of a game that I felt 4 99 in the App Store was completely worth it and even addicting. So this is it, this is what I got for you. The top 5 best iOS games of the year 2014. I hope you enjoyed that list, I hope some of those games sort of relate to you or maybe you didn't know about and you'll try them on now and you'll feel exactly the same like I did when I tried them off. They're absolutely amazing games and I'm sure, I'm sure there will be people out there who enjoy them as much as I did and what I wonder now is like what is your top 5 list for the iOS games in 2014? Let me know in the comment box below, remember to subscribe to our channel because there will be plenty more videos coming through and have a great day guys, I'll see you in the next video.